And a warm welcome. This is the scene here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. And here's the Wolves lineup. Joao Moutinho plays alongside Ruben Neves in the center of midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Raul Jimenez. And the contest begins. Holland. Now with De Bruyne. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. And Wolves in a position of menace. He's gone for goal. Oh, and current convert. Walker. Mares. Firing it in. Full credit. Wonderful stop. Delivering it. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner. And then Haaland demonstrates his ability in the air. He judges the flight, meets it solidly, and beats the keeper. That's how to head a ball. So underway once more. Manchester City with the advantage. A bit of running room now on the wing. Oh, good looking run. And crossed in the direction of the back post. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Given away by City. Well, he's certainly not alone. Nelson Semedo. And just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. De Bruyne. De Bruyne threading it through. Chance maybe. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. <laughs> so back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Loves to attack from the wide areas. 
But they took care of the situation defensively. Getting the better of his opponent. Well, not hard to read that pass. Room to roam for Wolves on the wing. A City free kick forthcoming. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Holland. De Bruyne. Mares. Well, I'll tell you what, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Sarabia. The cross is on. Could reduce the deficit. Off the post and back in play. Oh, great block. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. A City free kick forthcoming. De Bruyne. Holland. Wang Hee Chan. Back to Moutinho. A very timely interception. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Wang Hee Chan. That's not a bad ball. And still dangerous. And Moutinho with it. And they need to get tighter. And still they wait for the chance. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And that is good. So back in business with City very much the dominant side. Can they repeat that in the second 45? It is advantage Manchester City here. He must finish! Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Superstop. Lemina. Ruben Neves. Wonderfully weighted pass. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, it fizzled out. Raul Jimenez. Has eyes for goal. Couldn't quite finish. Well, if they can just get one, it will certainly make it interesting. And he's going to go back and issue a caution here. Well, the referee wasn't going to forget that, was he? Well, City haven't bossed the possession, as you can see, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Well, that's right, preserving the lead and doing it really well. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Now, looking dangerous here. Able to get a body in the way. And the danger still on. Poor attempt at a pass, really. And a creative look about this. Oh, this is looking promising. Must be. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot.
A very good tackle. And attempting the through ball. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. And a substitution in the offing. Into the final 20 minutes. Well, they might be onto something. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Walker failed to hold it. Pablo Sarabia. And he might be through here. Keeper did his job to begin with. And he clears it out of harm's way. So getting close to the end of this one, and City pushing all the right buttons. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Not much time to make up his mind. A real opening now. A really good chance for him, but he'd love to have that moment back, Stuart. Well, in those situations, you expect him to score or at least make the goalkeeper work. Nelson Semedo. And on the ball, Sarabia. Oh, showing excellent vision. Well, not troubling the goalkeeper at all there. And from that sort of distance, you should be troubling the goalkeeper. Technique let him down there. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 20, Bernardo Silva. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number 47, Phil Foden. To be replaced by number 10, Grealish. Jack Grealish. Was that again? Oh, it might be. Superbly read and executed. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Three minutes of added time here. Stones. Brilliant save. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well cleared away. And there goes the final whistle. And fans of Wolverhampton Wanderers probably aren't going to be in the best mood after this. But today they have to accept defeat. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the 